I'm Sasha, and welcome to the CyberKnife CK Cam. I've been joined by Christine, who is the Executive Director of the CyberKnife Society. Christine, can you tell us a little bit about what the CyberKnife Society is and what it is you guys do? Yes, the CyberKnife Society is a forum of users of the CyberKnife system made up of medical professionals who use the CyberKnife system to treat patients using radio surgery. Who is a member of the society? The membership consists of a collection of medical professionals such as radiation oncologists, surgeons, medical physicists, physicists, radiation therapists, and nurses. How long have you guys been in existence for? We've been in existence since 2002, originally under the auspices of Accuray. And then in 2008, we reorganized as a non-for-profit company to increase the clinical credibility of the society. So you, it's a society made up of physicists, clinicians that all use the CyberNet to treat. How do you bring everybody together? We have multiple forums, both via the web as well as face-to-face -face interaction meetings, such as our scientific meeting, we have protocol development committee meetings, and again, it brings all of the specialties together to share ideas, experiences, um, data gathering, etc. So essentially, you bring all these clinicians and physicists together to determine the best practices and ways to use the CyberNet for treatments, and then I guess what's next on the treatment horizon. Exactly. In the early days before radio surgery for extracranial, this was the forum. It gave the opportunity for physicians to gather to share their collective experiences and knowledge. For instance, surgeons with their anatomical expertise and critical structures combined with radiation oncologists with their knowledge of radiobiological effects yeah. and taking their experiences and understanding and creating protocols to develop or develop protocols for patients um, to undergo cyber knife treatment. So you mentioned a scientific meeting. Can you tell us a little bit more about that? Yes, actually it's a day and a half meeting. People from around the world who utilize the cyber knife come to the meeting as well as people who are interested in the cyber knife are invited to come, medical professionals, where they gather and share their own data but also learn from clinical and scientific practices of other centers using the CyberKnife system. Oh, that's great. Um, do you guys offer, I know continuing education credits are very important for a lot of meetings of this nature. Do you guys offer it for the scientific meeting? We actually do. We were awarded, believe it or not, 13 wow. CMEs for the uh, MDs as well as the nurses, and then nine and a half, I think, for dosimetrists and radiation therapists. The physicists were still waiting for CAMPEP to uh, notify us of the number of CEs, but for a day and a half, it's a capacity-filled meeting, all clinical and scientific um, experiences. That's great. Where would somebody go if they wanted to learn more information, gather more information on either the scientific meeting or the CyberNet Society? They would go to our website, uh, www.cksociety.org, and all of the information is there, as well as a, a myriad of other information related to CyberNet treatment and radio surgery. And as, as I understand it, on the website you have a closed forum for clinicians, and you also have some information for patients and patients' families. Yes, we have a very secure website for the members only where they can access white papers, protocols, treatment guidelines, presentations, uh, as well as interaction with the other peers. They have their contact information. On the public side, patients and their families and people who are interested in learning more about CyberKnife in general, we have a, a, a tremendous amount of information on that side as well. Oh, what a great resource. Thank you so much for taking the time to share that with us today. And My thank pleasure. you for watching. I'm Sasha with the CK Cam. See you next time. Thank you.